Good day. I'm Dr. Nigel Elliott, Senior Veterinarian at High Pro Division for Jamaica Broilers Group. Today we'll be speaking about piglet mortality. But before we talk about the piglets, let's look at the sow. A good sow for breeding must be fed on high pro sow gestation feed. This is a feed that is high in fiber, which is good for gut function during pregnancy. It is also provides ample nutrition for reproductive performance and also for litter size, which is what we want. The sows producing the piglets. What are some of the targets that we want from our sows? First of all, we want to look on the body conformation of the sows. We want a sow that has a nice round shoulder, a nice ham, as you see, nice round shape. We don't want one that is too thin where you see the spines protruding through the skin or the hip bones showing. This is a sign of a good sow. We also want one that has between 14 to 16 pairs of nipples. That you can look at good genetics from her and that she can produce some good piglets. We also want a sow that can give you on average 20 piglets per year and that is twice breeding is the kind of average targets we want from our sows. A sow that is too thin, that is emaciated, not eating, should be considered for culling. So our sows are what will be producing the piglets for profitable production. A complete feed for nursing sows is high pro sow lactation feed. This feed is highly formulated and specific for improving milk production with the sows. It has high levels of vitamins and micro minerals, much better than the gestation feed. Because during, pregnant, during litter, the sow will need more energy in order to produce the milk needed for its litter. But even with good feed and a good sow, Farmers are faced with piglet mortality. So let us look at some of the causes of piglet mortality and how we can help to prevent them. Let's look first at stillbirth. It is important that during farrowing, that the farmer is there at the time of farrowing. The farmer can help assist the sow if she is in a breech position or is having difficulty giving birth. A trained farmer with the assistance of a tech rep or a veterinarian would know how to insert his hand into the vagina and help to pull out the pig. If there is a dead pig, the farmer can assist and will make the ease of birth for the, for the sow. Another cause of piglet mortality is chilling or hypothermia. This is when the sow gives birth and there is no heat available. There is no heat lamp available, there is no litter or it might just be the very cold concrete. The farmers must make sure that they have a nice nesting box so as the piglets are born, they can put in that area and put on their heat lamp to help keep the piglet warm. When a piglet's born, it cannot um, produce its own heat. So the farmer will have to be there. Crushing. This is by far the major cause of piglet mortality. Without proper firing crates or a firing box, if the sow during birthing rolls and the farmer is not there, the sow can roll and crush the piglets. So it's very important that proper firing crates are built to prevent the sow from rolling on the piglets. Piglet diseases like respiratory and in the most common one during the farrowing, scoring or the diarrhea. We can help this by one, our sanitary methods doing farrowing. We want to try to keep the farrowing areas dry and clean as possible. Farrowing crates will definitely help to reduce the wetting and that the excreta from the pig and piglets will pass through so it keeps the floor what's dry. Piglets are curious. They'll always be sniffing and picking up things from the ground. If some of the sow feed is on the floor, the piglets eat it. Their system, their guts, is not prepared to deal with the grain feed. So that can cause the scoring. Hypro has a pre-starter feed. Hypro's piglet pre-starter feed, which is a strong milk-based feed. So it's a good transition between the sow's milk and the piglet starting to eat grain. Pig starter feed is formulated with our yeast-based all-natural product called Selmenax. And this helps improve the immunity 
the efficiency and the strength of the piglets during this time of transitioning from the mother's milk to grains. A piglet is born with low iron deficiency. Iron supplements is essential at birth. It can either be injectable or an oral administration. Clipping of the needle teeth is also an option and also clipping the end of the tail to prevent them salvaging and cannibalism among the piglets. Piglet mortality is running about 25% now in Jamaica among pig farmers. We want to reduce this as low as 10 to 15%. Follow these tips and also with high profiting program for your sows and piglets can ensure that we can reduce our piglet mortality and have the healthiest pigs within your operation. Good day.